All right, what's up guys, making another video today. So what we're about to do today is just pretty much take Zeus to the vet real quick. He has to go get some shots because he has to like, he is like, it's like shots, no, actually no, it's not shots. He has to get pills, that like monthly pills I have to give him because it's like for parasites and stuff. So yeah, so I'm gonna take him there, be doing that. And also afterwards, I'm gonna be going to get some food. I don't know, I'm kind of feeling some Taco Bell, probably I'm not gonna get Taco Bell, but maybe some Panda for, ah, I don't know, there's so many choices, but yeah. So today's my day off, so I'm just chillaxing right now. So um, I guess other than that, guys, so let's pretty much just get started. Uh, I think for right now, I'm just gonna be joining, B just be seeing B roll. Or no, you'll see B roll after I take uh, Zeus to the vet. So let's get it. It's so bright out right now, like it's crazy, but yeah. So now we gotta take Zeus to the vet. So let's see if he gets on. Oh, he's more than likely gonna get on. So, <laughs> oh my gosh, Zeus, hurry up, go, go, go. Oh, what's wrong with my camera? Oh, it's fogging up right now. Uh, it was so it was so like hot in the car that it started fogging up when I got in. That's 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 not a good sign. That's really not a good sign. Look at Zeus right here. Oh my gosh, he's getting so big. <laughs> he know he already knows the deal. That's what, that's the good thing about like uh, taking him out places when he was young was he already knew when growing up he's gonna be like in the seat just chilling. So yeah, so. Oh, it's so hot out right now. It's a hundred degrees. It says it's a hundred degrees right now like outside you can see that a hundred Come on guys. I'm not used to this I was literally just transferring from having like rainy days and stuff and also having days where it hails and having cold cold days Like mornings. I don't know like in Texas uh, during like uh, I want to say during I wouldn't say the winter time, but after the winter time, I don't know if that's fall or spring. I think it's spring. So, boy, even in the fall, you know, it'd be like really cold in the morning. So you have to like switch your air like to cold, but like right after you get to school, switch it to hot just when you turn on your car, it's gonna be hot. No way, opposite. You're gonna be switching it to hot when it's in the morning and then cold when it's in the afternoon because I don't know, Texas weather's like that. It's just so bipolar, but yeah. Now we gotta take Zeus to the vet. Look at him. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. <laughs> Oh Zeus. Uh, so they told me to bring him when he was like over 50 pounds, but um, the thing was it hasn't been a month since I took him to the vet, you know? So I was like, why would I take him to the vet again if it hasn't been a month? It's just like me going over there and just getting things and me having to wait another month, you know? But now he like weighs over 50. He weighs over 50 pounds now. He probably weighs a good 60, honestly. He's gotten real, real big. I remember when like I first got him, he was like right here. This is what his body would be like. His body would just be like his leg to his butt. Like that's what it, that would be his whole body before. But yeah, guys. So let's get started. All right, guys. So we're finally done with the zoo, uh, the vet. Actually, it didn't take that long time. So I just got this, and it's this is for what is this for? What is this for? It prevents heartworms and parasites inside his body. And then I have this, which is just net guard, which is I guess it's what does it do? It, pre it prevents fleas and ticks, so that's why I really like about these two. So, uh, honestly, I came in here thinking I was going to spend like $200, but I honestly just spent $34. That's it. So, it's not that much money, you know. And then, um, look look at this. This is pretty crazy. This is what I thought was crazy. So, um, he came in and he weighed 55.7 pounds, I'm pretty sure. So, the first time I ever brought him in, he, he weighed 19 pounds. After that, literally a month after, he gained 11 pounds. So... Well, not a month after, literally, like, oh, but it's like somewhat close to a month after he gained 11 pounds. Then afterwards, he gave 12 pounds, and just like he's been getting big, and now he gained 13 pounds. So Zeus, oh, he's over here dying from the heat, but yeah, Zeus gained a lot of weight, a lot, a lot of weight. So I don't know, he's gonna be a big boy. He's gonna be a big boy. I'm, I'm like pretty sure he's gonna be like over 100 pounds when he's like a full grown adult. He's five months old right now, and he's already big. So. I don't know, I think that's pretty crazy. So what am I gonna do? Uh, I don't know if I wanna take him to the like Petco and get him groomed up, because I feel like I could do that myself, you know? Like, obviously not give him a haircut, but look at his, his hair's not even that long, you know? So, I don't know, maybe just go to Petco, like drop him off home right now, and then go to Petco, and then like get like uh, nail clippers for him, and also get, I wanna say nail clippers, and then, I guess that's pretty much it. That's all I really need is honestly because I have shampoo for him at the house. So just nail clippers and then just go get some food for me. So I think that's what we're going to do. So let's go ahead head back home. That's such a bad stutter right there. But yeah, guys, let's go head back home. What's up, guys? So we finally dropped Zeus off. So what we're going to do is just, uh, I think we're going to go to Petco to try to get him some nail clippers because I don't know. I feel like I need to start cutting his nails because his nails are getting really long and they're, they're pretty painful. So, you know, I'm really not trying to have him just scratch me all the time when he tries to get up on me. I mean, I know he's trying to be playful and all, but it does kind of get irritating because it's like, 
it hurts. So I'm not trying to like have him hurt me all the time when he tries to play, you know? So yeah, so we're gonna be doing that. And then also we're gonna be heading out to go get some food. I think, I don't know what I'm feeling. Honestly, I'm, I'm feeling some Taco Bell, but I'm also feeling some Panda, feeling some Chipotle, feeling some Canes. Like I'm feeling everything really. Like I'm just, I'm fat guys. I really am, I'm fat. Um, I get paid Thursday, so I really have like, I saved up like most of my money. I haven't really spent anything. I feel bad. I feel like I have to spend something. You know, I feel like I have to buy something, but I don't know. So I'm gonna be looking into some things. Maybe buy some athlete shirts. Maybe not. You know, I don't know. I really I feel like I need some new gym clothes. Honestly, I don't know. I feel like I need some new gym clothes. I don't. I, other than that, I really have nothing else to buy. So I'm gonna be looking into buying some gym clothes. Um, what else should I pay? I have to pay off the camera, but I feel like I can pay that off easily. I might get like I might uh, withdraw a hundred dollars and give that to my mom to pay it off because uh, it's eight hundred thirty-two. I think it's been two, three months already, so I have enough time. Like if I just gave her a hundred every month, that I'd be like a hundred every month, and I'll be like set because it's just like eight months in, and I'll be done. I'd, I'd, like that'd be it. But I don't know. So yeah, um, for right now, guys, just enjoy the beer and then I'll talk to y'all when I'm gonna get to when I decide to what food place I want to get. Honestly. <laughs> And it's all you and me We'll kiss the sky goodnight Just run away with me darling We'll get real lost We'll get real lost again Just run What's up guys? So we're finally at Petco now. So I'm just gonna show you what I got for Zeus. So I got this little, uh, this little, uh, I don't know what they're called. They're called Nutri Dent Complete. So it just like cleans his teeth. So like 360 action. So yeah. So hopefully he does like those. I know he liked the greenies, and this is like pretty much like a better version of the greenies, I guess you could say, because it gets his whole teeth and stuff. But the greenies just got like a portion of his teeth. So yeah. And I also got him nail clippers. And the way they work is just you put his nails, you put Zeus's nails in there, and like you like it goes up. So it's just like a little holder. So like that and then cuts his nails so hopefully he doesn't give me that much of a hassle trying to cut his nails but yeah so what we're about to go do now is just pretty much uh, go head out to academy see what they got over there because i do actually want to get some gym clothes guys so i'm gonna see what they got and hopefully they do have some stuff that i do like i'm probably gonna get some shorts more than likely but um other than that i don't know about shirts i don't feel like i'm gonna get any shirts because they have like some really expensive shirts that aren't that good of quality like i don't know i used to when I, remember, I remember when i was a kid i used to get like I used to like get crazy for shirts like like Nike shirts and stuff but now I really don't care for them you know they're like it's literally just a name brand now I wear like literally I think this costed me seven dollars like I wear clothes that are like seven dollars but look really nice so it's just how you like how you um how you pretty much uh what's it called how you pretty much match yourself with your clothing you know so yeah so we're gonna be doing that and then i guess also what should we do oh i'm gonna get some shorts no nah, i already said shorts i'm gonna get some socks that's what i need i need socks i need new socks so yeah we gonna be doing that so i'll catch up with you afterwards show you what i got so yeah let's get it started all right so i went in there and there was like nothing i liked honestly like there's literally nothing i like i tried on four things and it was like two she shirts and two uh shorts I forgot it socks. Oh my gosh, I forgot it socks. Oh well, it doesn't matter. Honestly, I don't really want to get anything from there. I don't know. I feel like name brands really do suck. So I'm gonna see if I can, if I can, like, if I'm able to, uh, if I'm now able to shop in Gymshark because I love Gymshark. Gymshark's a really nice uh, company, and I really do like uh, like their stuff and the things they do. But if I'm not able to, I'm gonna go with Athlete, and Athlete's also a really good company. But I prefer Gymshark over Athlete. I don't know why. And also because I was uh, there's like boxers and stuff on Gymshark that I want to get. Like they have like really like nice uh, I guess they're just called boxers like you know just boxers and they have like some really nice stuff also socks and things I don't know a lot of things I want to be able to get you know so yeah I'm gonna be doing that first and if I'm not able to use my card on there then I'm gonna switch to athlete and athlete they have like a lot of stuff they also have shorts and then some of them are sold out but others are like aren't sold out so I'm gonna try to see if they have like smalls and obviously they're probably gonna be sold out on a lot of smalls but I'm just hoping that they have like smalls that I'm able to buy but yeah Instead of me doing that, so I don't know. Uh, just name brands suck, especially like Nike. Nike, I'm sorry, but Nike really does suck. And I just hate Nike. I don't know. People just, uh, it's overrated, honestly. People just hype it up too much, but it's not really that cool. There wasn't really anything else like a cool. Uh, they had Adidas, but Adidas wasn't really. Adidas is like soccer things, you know. It's not really things that I need, but yeah. So what am I gonna do? I think I, I feel like I want to go see some Chick Fil A, either Chick Fil A, Taco Bell, um, In and Out. I don't know. It's really hard. There's like a lot of food places around here. Um, what do I really want to get though? 
I'm really feeling some Taco Bell, honestly. I don't know why. I don't know why I'm feeling some Taco Bell. But it's either Taco Bell or Chick-fil-A. Uh, I don't know. Chick-fil-A is literally like right there though. So that's the thing. Like it's closer, but Taco Bell is like a farther drive. I think I'm going to go with, uh, let's see. I don't know. You know, I don't. I really don't know. It's so hard, but I really, I really want to talk about. I'm sorry, I'm being so indecisive right now. But forget it. Let's go get some Chick Fil A. Cool. All right, so we're home now, guys. Oh, you can see how dark I am. Like you can see the difference. Ah, <laughs> oh, it's funny. All right, so yeah, so we're home now. Here's Zeus, right here. Look, he's gonna come up on the view. There he is. <laughs> you can barely see him though. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna give him this stuff. Oh, let me get in the view real quick. Let me tilt this up a little bit. So yeah. Alright, so we're gonna give him this stuff real quick. See if he likes it or not. Um I don't know how to open this honestly. Let's see. Oh, I'm, I'm done. I'm done. Still don't know how to open this. I feel like this should be like a spot, you know, to like peel it off, but there's not, so I'm about to just like break it, so. Oh, that came off easily. Alright, there, now it's good. So we're opening it now. So hopefully he does like this. I mean, it's good for him, so like it's healthy for him. So I'm hoping he like eats it easily and does like really like it a lot. Oh, they're so small. What the heck? Like look at that comparison to my palm. What the heck? That's so small. Oh well, it doesn't matter. So let's give him some food, see if he likes it. Oh no, I dropped it. <laughs> uh, all right, Zeus, come here. All right, sit, sit. All right, stay, stay. No, ah, oh. sit, stay, stay. No, oh, good boy. He resisted the temptation. Hopefully, he does like it. Let's see. Let's see if he likes it or not. He looks like he's eating it. He looks like he kind of likes it. Oh, he dropped it. He dropped it. If he picks it up again, that means he likes it. He picks it up again, that means he likes it. I don't know if he likes it or not. I don't know. I bet he feels weird that I'm like recording him or something, you know? So yeah, guys. So we're already home right now. So let me show you what I got from Chick-fil-A. So I obviously got Chick-fil-A, guys. Got some nice water right here, you know? Gotta go healthy. Like I said, little things do matter, guys. So obviously you got the waffle fries. Waffle fries are always the best. Um, I got ketchup. So this is the way to go. So the way to go with Chick-fil-A is to get two packets of ketchup. You get Chick-fil-A sauce, but you get three Chick-fil-A sauce. So you outdo the ketchup. Obviously, I'm just using the ketchup for the fries, so yeah. Then we also got one sandwich, and we got another sandwich. Woo! So it's pretty much like a thousand calories in total, I'm pretty sure. So yeah, I'm just trying to, my camera just like went back. <laughs> Sorry, guys. So I'm just trying to like really eat up right now, just get some really nice have protein and like carbs, fat, I mean, you know, so just some calories. So yeah, just trying to do that before I go to the gym. So we're going to be doing... Pull day today, so deadlifting today. So actually, last night, I think I went to sleep at, I went to sleep at like five and I had to wake up at, uh, I went to sleep at five and I had to wake up at like eight. So yeah, that was actually a terrible decision, but you know what, I'll be fine. So yeah, let's start eating this up and I'll catch up with y'all later. So right now I'm actually uploading the vlog so you can see it right here. It says trying to ma trying to get a max, 40%. So it is taking some time, but you know, it doesn't really matter. I really have nothing to do right now. I'll probably play The Last of Us. Um, the other part, there's like a left behind one. It's like a little sequence to it. It's like a little small sequence before the events happen. So yeah. Uh, for, but so yeah. Other than that, guys, really nothing else to say. So I'm just gonna be getting done eating, and I'm gonna check. Oh, I'm gonna check the athlete things. Let me go check the athlete and gym shark stuff, and then I'll talk to y'all and keep uh, keep y'all updated. See if I really did get something, or just you know if I'm just not I'm just gonna wait for a little bit. But yeah, I'm gonna go check that out, guys, and I'll keep up with y'all. Guys, it's uh, it's been a little bit, right? <laughs> it's already dark outside, so. It's been a, it's been some time since we last talked. I think it's a, I think it's been exactly, not exactly, but it's been pretty much five hours, I think. Five hours since we last talked, I'm pretty sure. So, I want to say four. I want to say it's been four hours, but it's probably been five. So, yeah. So, I looked into Athlete while I was eating, so my... The video was uploading, so that's why I took a nap. Because I didn't really do anything on like online. So I video because my video was uploading. Oh, it's blurry. Now it's good. But now it is good. Um, so yeah, so I looked in the athlete. I didn't really like any of the athlete things, so I was just like, you know what? I'm just gonna I'm just not gonna mess with that. So um plus they didn't I don't know, they didn't have things I really like, so yeah. And plus the site load up like loaded up so slow, like 
Uh, it's like, I don't know, like the pictures like took so long to just generate. I don't know. So yeah, I really like the Gymshark. I really, really like Gymshark, but I can't get it because my car doesn't let me get it. So I don't know. I'm going to try to see if I could like do something because I was going to spend over $200 on it and it was going to give me free express shipping. Express shipping is just like one to two days shipping. It was going to give it to me for free and I was like, that's pretty cool. So I'm going to try to see if I could go get it like, I don't know, maybe like a prepaid card. You know what I'm talking about? Like a prepaid card is just pretty much like a card that already has funds in it and you can use it easily. So try to see if I could do that. I more than likely won't be able to do that because it it's not going to have like my name on it so i don't know i need to look more into it but i might message him actually i might message him and tell him what's up and see like if they could do anything about it but yeah so what am i gonna do we're gonna head to the gym right now um i don't have my chalk in my bag but um because they have chalk there at the gym since i asked them to do it and they like they bought chalk from me i was like that's pretty cool so yeah so i brought my towel and shampoo because i'm gonna shower over there just because it's uh it's already 11 35 so it's gonna be like 12 when, like 12 when i get done lifting like deadlifting. so you know i just need it's gonna take me like an hour and a half to actually get through the workout but yeah hopefully you do like this uh, gym workout man I, i'm hoping y'all really do like the gym workout i felt like the gym workout was really like really really nice i mean, my, pro my program i feel like it's a really nice program so um preston's not able to work out with us today obviously because it's really late like I took a nap so I can't really work out so yeah so I have my pre-workout right here I have uh, my gym stuff in the trunk right now so I guess I'm like really excited to see what my deadlift max is gonna be guys I can't wait so let's get started I have no clue what went over there I have no clue what's going on I think a trailer fell in the ditch again that's crazy <laughs> All right, what's up, guys? So we're at the gym now. So that last clip y'all saw was like that 18 wheeler was like stuck in a ditch, and there's like cops over there trying to help him out, like get him out of the ditch. There, there are always like there's always there always is like an accident over there because there's like I've seen like five 18 wheelers there in that ditch, but there's probably been way more because I've never witnessed it. You know, I've heard like more being there, but just like I don't know, I don't know. It's like such a risky term, like I wouldn't even try it, honestly. So I don't know. So yeah, what we're about to do we're at the gym right now. We're gonna be doing our uh, deadlift today. So we're gonna be doing, we're gonna be warming up with one plate on each side, and then we're gonna switch up to two plates and three plates, and then from there on, I think I'm gonna add a 25 to do 365. That is my previous max. It's 365, and I'm gonna see if I am able to do that. If I'm not able to do that, then. I'm, I'm gonna be able to do that. Come on, why am I saying I'm not even able to do that? All right, I'm trying to aim for 380 on my deadlift or 385. So let's just see how it works out, guys. So let's get started. All right, so I weighed the bar and it actually does weigh 45. So there's no thinking it doesn't weigh 55. Like it doesn't weigh 45. So it weighs 45, but you know how hard it is like to make a like bar stand up by itself. So it was like 45.7, but 45 pounds, all right? So we are gonna be doing 365 today. Like my, my max is 365. That's what I meant to say. It is 365. It's not above or lower. So yeah, let's get started. What's going on, guys? Brandon in the commentary today. So right here, you see me starting off just warming up my deadlift. I'm pretty much just doing 135 and just switched up to 225. And then uh, next thing I'm going to do is 315. So I'm really happy with uh, today's results. I, obviously, it wasn't. I was aiming for 380, but I wasn't able to do 380. Oh, look at this. So they didn't have their chalk there. So I had to grab chalk out of like a, like actual chalk out of the out of the ab room because they have like a little chalkboard and they write stuff on it. So I had to, I took that because I don't know where the chalk was. So I was like, you know what? This is like I didn't bring my chalk, so I ha I need chalk today. So here you see me doing 365. So I got it up pretty like fairly easily, honestly. So that's why I was like, you know. I'm gonna do uh, 10 more pounds. So I did three, uh, 375. So this is me doing 375. Like I'm really, really happy with me doing 375. Um, you see, I felt like I could have done three, like 380 at least. I don't know. I, I went for three, like 385, but I wasn't successful. So it's whatever, you know. So now you see me starting off my lap pull downs with uh, five sets of 10. I'm pretty sure. So let me check real quick, real for you guys. Um, I really did enjoy my program today. I feel like it was a really nice program. Sorry if I'm whispering, guys. I'm really not trying to wake up anyone. It's 3 in the morning right now. <laughs> so, yeah, I did uh, lap pull downs for 5 sets of 10. Just really focusing on bringing the weight, like the bar, all the way down, contracting my back. And right here, you see me doing rope pull downs. You've never seen me do this before, but it pretty much helps out your back and also your lats. And this, you just keep your arms straight pretty much. You just go down with the rope, and it pretty much contracts your back and also really, really wears out your lats. That's my, my, my lats are dead right now, but you just do four sets of 12 with this. And then just keep doing it. Like, no uh, little rest time, honestly, because uh, doing 12 reps, you just need to hurry up and get the, just get the uh, sets over with. And now we're doing seated back rows i'm doing five sets of ten really focusing on contracting my back um i'm i'm like turning my my forearm like i'm twisting them in so it works more in my back instead of just going like pulling it just regularly so i'm like twisting it in and then twisting them out every time i go like release so yeah i did the seated back rows for let me check real quick uh five sets of ten and now i'm doing rope hammer curls for five sets of twelve really just trying to go really fast and really get that good contraction and pump on my biceps now we're going to be doing uh, the next thing is going to be rope pulley curls 
doing four sets of 20 the reason i did so many reps is because um i'm doing 15 no, i'm doing 10 pounds so not that much weight but i'm just really going on uh trying to go fast keep my arms contracted a lot and just making sure that i don't like uh take a, like a lot of rest time you know so just really making sure my bicep doesn't get some time to rest so now you see me getting both t uh, both types of angles from my right side and left side just to make sure y'all really just see the difference in my arms um i should have got a better angle on my left side but i really couldn't so sorry about that guys but next thing we're gonna be doing is gonna be the uh con concentrated curls i'm pretty sure so we're gonna be doing uh four sets of ten with this so that's ten on each hand and just really focusing on contraction of the muscles um i feel like there's a better way to work this out but um the thing is about doing this you want to make sure you're like leaning to the right side if you're doing your right arm or to the left side if you're working your left arm and you're bringing the weight inwards if that makes any sense so to work out your long head and say you're working out your short head you're working out your long head if you bring it in and you're working out your short head if you're bringing it out so we're just doing uh, i'm pretty sure we're just doing 20 pounds because my my wrist is still kind of messed up but obviously i don't want to mess it up even more so that's why i'm doing low weight now we're doing dumbbell curls for three sets of failure so this is the first set i think i did like 20 something reps 25 26 i don't know i was just making sure that i was going i was doing alternate dumbbell curls so i'm making sure that i get like a rep in each hand before so um i'm pretty sure i didn't like stop at one hand too i'm pretty sure i uh, equaled them out like it was even between the hands so you know so yeah hopefully i mean i really do like doing burnouts uh burnout reps so i think i'm gonna be focusing on really doing burnout reps on my shoulders tricep and bicep because those are the things that really do um really do benefit when you do failure sets so i'm not gonna be doing them on chest maybe i will do it on chest I don't know, maybe on cable flies I'll do it on chest. But yeah, I really do like doing it on bicep, tricep, and shoulders. So hopefully you guys like it too. So I'm just trying to make sure that I'm informative on some of this stuff and really just helping y'all better yourselves as well as, as as well as bettering myself. So yeah, next thing we're going to be doing is doing uh, just to finish off the session. It's just going to be pull-ups. We're going to be doing three sets of ten. Right here you see me fail. I'm like getting really, really tired. <laughs> But yeah, guys, we're doing three sets of ten right here for pull-ups and making sure I go all the way up since I am using the assistance, uh, the assistant uh, seat, I guess you could call it. Just making sure I go all the way up and track my back. So I'm really trying to do this. So we're just doing three sets of ten and making sure that I better myself, like trying to get my pull-up game, <laughs> pull-up game, pull-up game better. So yeah, guys, this is it for the commentary. Hopefully you did enjoy the video, guys. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I guess I'm out, guys. Hopefully you do like the program. Peace. All right, guys, so we're finally done working out now. So I'm going to weigh myself to show you how much I actually weigh and just talk about it real quick. So let me weigh myself real quick. And I'm going to go, like, full out and actually take my shoes off, too. So, all right, let me weigh myself real quick. Oh, let me fix this out real quick. All right. Oh, my camera's going to fall. There, we're good. All right, so I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm going to weigh, like, 140. Uh, I'm weighing 146. I was going to say 147, but all right. So here we are. So the weight is 146.4. And the fact that I'm actually doing like more than half, it's like almost three, no, 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 I'm not gonna say three times my weight, but it's almost three times my weight. It's like somewhere close. So I'm weighing 146 and I'm actually like deadlifting 375 and that's pretty crazy. So that's pretty much 230, like 220, 229 pounds over my weight. And so that's pretty just crazy just how much I'm deadlifting compared to like how much I actually weigh. So the workout was really good today, but yeah, it's time to get a shower. So I'm gonna take a shower real quick and then I'm gonna go home. So I'll talk to y'all when I'm done. I'm gonna drop my phone. Oh my God. All right, what's up guys? So we're finally done showering. So I wanna talk to y'all a little bit about something. It's about my belt. So I just, uh, during the workout, I bought a belt. It's uh, if you don't know what it is, it's pretty much called an Inzer belt. So what it is, it's like a, it's like a 13. I think I got the, like the good one. It's like a 13 millimeter width uh, belt, and it's like really, really durable. So the one here, it's it's sucky. I'm sorry, but it really does suck. And that's what made me like, I I've been thinking about getting this belt for a couple months now, but it's like so it, it was expensive. Now I don't think it's that expensive now, but it was pretty expensive. But now just like you know, I had money to spend and I wanted to buy something, so I bought that. And I'm so happy I got it. It has it costs like $123, but I feel like it's gonna wor be worth so so much to me, and especially like it's gonna bet me so benefit me so much for my workout. So it's such a nice belt. So what it is, it's like it's like a latch. You pretty much adjust it to your body, and it's like you put it on, so like, you connect it, and then you latch it down, and that's how it gets like really. Instead of having like little holes you put them through, it's like a latch, and it's like really cool. It's like a lever. So yeah, guys, I bought that, and I can't wait for it to come in. I was trying to get like a one day delivery, but it didn't allow that. It just did the standard delivery. So I was like, all right, you know what? I'm just gonna get that, but I can't 
long way for that to come in, guys. So I'm gonna tell you, it's gonna benefit me so, so much. I'm probably gonna use it when I bench too, because my bench, I, I feel like I could benefit somewhat good from my bench. So I was talking to someone here, he's right here. He's like in the gym right now. His name's Duke. Ooh. All right, sorry, it wasn't focusing. So yeah, his name's Duke. He told me he would help me with my bench because he told me like the most he's bench was like 365. And I was like, you know what? I really wanna get my bench up. Sorry for the, if it's blurry, guys. Let me focus in real quick. All right, there we go. So yeah, he told me to help my bench up because he did 365 and I was like, you know what? I've been stuck at 175 for so long. And the last time I did bench, I, I went down to 170. I like lost my max. So I told him that and he was like, you know what? I can help you with your bench. I can like try to give you some tips. And I was like, you know what? I'd like for you to do that. So I tried to see if we could do it Friday, but he's like working Friday and I'm working Friday. So our, like our schedule doesn't match up. So yeah. So I told him Monday, if, we, if Monday he could do it, that would be really cool. So we're going to try Monday and then, um, I guess, oh, I don't know, but yeah. Um, so hopefully that does work out. Hopefully it does teach me some tricks and like actually gets my bench up because I really, really need it. I want to get on that thousand club guys. I really want to bench over like bench squat and deadlift over a thousand. I'm getting so, so close to deadlifting 400 pounds, man. Like I'm so close. I'm literally 25 pounds away 25 pounds away i'm one plate away like literally 125 away from getting that like i'm so so excited for that so yeah guys so and also another thing i want to talk about is i'm probably going to buy gym shark tomorrow because i'm going to um what i'm going to do is i'm going to i think i have like how much do I have in my bank? 400 something. I have like 400 something. I want to say like 480. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to withdraw 320, give 100 for my uh, camera, and then uh, buy with a 220, I'm going to buy Gymshark guys. So I'm going to do that and have like one day delivery or one to two day delivery. So I can't, can't wait. So what I was going to get from Gymshark, I was going to get socks, uh, underwear, shirts, and shorts. And it was like, gonna, I don't know. Like it's like things I need, you know, I need socks. It was going to be uh, six pairs of socks, um, four pairs of underwear, and then also I don't know how many shorts and shirts it was, but yeah, guys, I'm gonna do that, and I can't, can't wait. Like, you, I, I'm so excited to get it because I really need new gym stuff. And Gym Shark is such a good quality brand, and like, I don't know, for me to be sponsored by Gym Shark, it's like that would be really, really cool. So yeah, guys. I'm gonna close up the video nice. So if you do like the video, guys, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, guys. As always, let me know what I get better on. As always, guys, go out, live better, better yourself, better your mind, better your soul, better your knowledge, especially your knowledge, guys. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.